What is up? It's been a while since I made a cover video upload. I've been really busy. So we're gonna do something really quick today and check out a very cheap flute I got from Timu. I haven't looked at this really yet. When I opened the package, I was like, yeah. So I put it aside and here we are. We got this thing. I think I got it for $269. And then plus tax. Yeah, I just thought it was really weird. So in the picture, I wasn't able to see this like little hole here, I think. So I wasn't sure how it worked. Cause it, it looked like it had a hole for blowing. So I'm a little bit confused. Let me check out the uh, listing. To start your musical journey with vertical flute, perfect for beginner learners. Perfect for beginner learners. Let's try to open this up. I'm gonna wipe it down. I'm pretty sure this stuff is not clean, just an alcohol pad. Heard from uh, viewers in Discord that alcohol can wipe off some of the paint from these uh, engravings, so just watch out for that. For this, it seems like the ink is all coated in. Whoa. A little bit of a design over here i'm not really sure what like a flower lotus kind of thing what is this kind of a kind of a short flute let's see the fingers probably go here okay so very close to oh wait oh is this another like one of those recorder flutes with membrane though yeah so what's strange is it, it looks like this would be the the armature hole or the where you blow but i don't think it is and in the pictures none of these pictures showed a membrane put on there okay let's see okay someone covered it up it's a diesel style flute in a review someone says this is a diesel style flute make sure to put a membrane or tape on the hole okay let's try with tape first a piece of tape Ooh. has a very strong wood smell you can see there's a like a cork there usually for recorders they kind of narrow down the section this is just a big chunk that goes in your mouth and the whistle portion is on the bottom <laughs> this thing <is> weird. <laughs> feels weird putting this all right never mind Not very in tune, but uh, just seems like handcrafted, so can't expect much under three dollars. Let's put on a membrane and see if it sounds different. Okay, the membrane is on. Loosen up the membrane a little bit. It actually sounds kind of unique. It's not like the other recorded flute the plastic one that I got before, where it started to sound more and more like a Diza. But it might be, I don't know, it might be either the material or that I'm not getting this membrane loose enough. Let me try to loosen it a little bit more. The high so and the high fa is a little bit hard to uh, they don't really connect very well. So the fa is like, the high fa needs to be a certain amount of airflow. It can't be too high or else it gets a different note. Right? Can't be too soft. You gotta get up.
Uh, if you want to connect the notes from so to fa, I tried earlier. It is. I don't think it's doable. Uh, would I say it's worth it to buy something like this? Um, no. I just, I just was curious because they showed pictures of this open side, but they didn't show the the whistle thing, the whistle part. So I was curious. Now I'm seeing it. It all makes sense. I mean, I guess you can play around with it if you want to go the cheapest route and the easiest option for just playing some kind of woodwind. But I'm maybe a recorder would be better because you don't have this thing to worry about, um, and the quality is probably going to be a little bit better because they're maybe molded, right, uh, manufactured uh, through machines instead of handcrafted. Thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video.